kind of angled on this one, and he's going to pump it through the uprights and good. And the third 20-yard field goal of the season for Gavin Patterson gives South Alabama the early 3-0 lead here in Mobile. And Carden has it blocked. Oh! And it's blocked out of the air, and that could go back for six. There goes Gus Nave, the freshman. How do you do? May going to swing it out here for Miles, who's been very active in the offense here tonight. Ball is out, and it is recovered by the Jaguars in the end zone for a touchdown. Things go from bad to worse, and a flag comes out, but a touchdown for the Jaguars in the end zone after the fumble by Miles inside the five-yard line. Play action. Davis scrambling, throwing downfield, and it is caught. with the touchdown. They pitch to Xavier Johnson going short side, and did he get in? He did. Touchdown. Xavier Johnson runs it in. So third down. Davis going to crank it to the corner, and it's caught for a touchdown, and Jameer Taylor gets that catch back. Remember, he had one negated earlier in the quarter, not this time. Jameer Taylor's first career touchdown catch that will count will be for a touchdown and it's 44 to nothing yeah a quick wheel route here oh great protection by alexander beat on the wheel route and the ball was a little under thrown but uh, didn't matter and south alabama has put their 44th point on the board and patterson will try to make it 45. he does South Alabama with a 45 to nothing lead on Alabama A&M late in the third quarter as Dallas Davis throws his second touchdown pass of the night. 